username, 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 username. One of these days I will invest in one of these settings. Username, 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 username. I just don't know how to change it. See, how do you change that? I don't know how. I don't know how. You guys can hear me though, yeah? You can hear me? Apparently I'm on YouTube as well. I've got to check that. <laughs> this is my first time trying it. Damn, there she is. Yikes. You, you can't, okay. Oh, you're messing with me. <laughs> oh, wow. So there's people on YouTube and on Twitter. This is my first time doing that. Um, if you guys managed to catch um, my earlier retro first ever stream, you'll know that I... Oh, multi-stream. That's cool. Read only. Um, I was playing Leisure Suit Larry. I am trying to figure out all these overlays. <laughs> I figured out my camera this time around though, which is cool. This is what it looks like now with the better camera, um, but not the better border. The border doesn't fit the higher def. A username, 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 username. Yeah, I have no idea how to figure that out yet, but baby steps, baby steps. Uh, a big hello to everyone who's just joined. Barrage underscore 35 just followed. Dr. Achion just followed. Dingus McCracken. <laughs> Shinon09, Bex to Hope. Ah, oh, hello. Um, yeah, wow, a bunch of different names. Just trying to grow the stream a little bit. Yes, listening to you on YouTube, says Brad. Sorry, all caps. Yes, listening to you on YouTube. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying a bunch of new things. If you are on YouTube, give it a sub. If you're on Twitch, give it a follow. Uh, a big hello. But Legend of Larry is a game that I used to play when I was a kid. I never played two or um, it's one or three. I only ever played two, which is Legend of Larry goes looking for love in several wrong places. Um, when we first started this stream, I realized that you can't save it because you don't have a floppy disk. Uh, this is on archives.org, archive.org. You can go back and look at all these retro games. Sometimes they crash. Uh, I am going to try and finish this, but I didn't, I, I re-actually did everything that we'd done in the previous stream. Apparently there's a clip of that if you wanna check it out. But basically, I'm playing Larry, who's just an unfortunate, well, I'm a slug at the moment, but um, he's a down and out guy who's just been dumped. Uh, so I picked up a dollar from my ex-girlfriend's uh, garage. I bought a lottery ticket. The woman who was um, overseeing the lottery tickets just basically read me the numbers. So I read them back to her and she's like, oh my God, you win. I accidentally went on a dating show where I won a cruise, definitely accidentally, like should not have won that one, but I did. Then I went to spin the lucky wheel and won a million dollars. Yes, this game is a little not safe for work. Uh, and YouTube's around 20 seconds behind. So there you go. Um, uh, hello. Cheshire Wolf, so happy to see you, missed you in the moderator. Moderator's gonna be back, guys. Maybe I'll kick this off with a little Q&A first uh, while we get started. Uh, Garth McMurray, thank you so much for following along on Twitch. Uh, we've got some familiar faces uh, in the chat, which is amazing. Apparently I can unlock some sort of achievement on Twitch if like 50 of you talk at the same time. And there's only 42 there. How many have we got over? And there's 31 over on YouTube. So there's, you know, baby steps doing it early days, trying to get uh, a handle on how to make this look good, how to set it in a geek bomb style. I don't even know if those three things are doing anything. I have a lot of research to do and I've got a, it's a whole new world that I have not really been a part of. Um, but, ah, oh, 
Christian saying you had so much fun last night. Christian Downs, if I'm not mistaken, because yeah, you posted a photo from it last night. Zach, hello. Uh, hello, musty chapstick. Hi, Maud. Brad from Katoomba. Katoomba! New South Wales. Um, and then Casey completely forgot about this game. Yeah, buckle up, guys. Um, yes, thank you, Reverend Puck. They will get ironed out in time. It won't happen overnight, but it will happen, and that is why you guys are day oneers, as far as I'm concerned, when it comes to my streaming. Uh, Glass Dagger 22 thank you so much for following. Um... Wowie, that's that's awesome. So please, obviously, feedback is the feedback channel is well and truly open. If the sounds aren't great, uh, the video quality is better though, right, Seb? How much better does this look? I had no idea that it automatically syncs your webcam. I didn't know that from the last stream last night, where I streamed Knights of the Old Republic two because I can't get the first original Kotor to work. Hello, Jake. Um, I don't know. Does anyone does anyone want a mod in the YouTube? Could get that happening there's just so few of you that I'm not super concerned at the moment yes the camera does look a lot better the only problem is the dimensions of this make it more of a square whereas the other ones are a little bit more of a 16.9 I think um, Maddie Tretz says hey from Ontario have you been back to snowy country since the car video that's right I went to Sundance um, that was beginning of 2017 no I haven't really been back to the snow since then and if you're wondering why I've got so much makeup on, guys, I just finished shooting today's show. It's a very, very earth tone feel. And I kind of got inspired by last night's Sith uh, adventures. I got little Miss Zell just down here being her cute self on the carpet. Um, I've got my water bottle. I've got a good attitude. Yeah, no, tell me about it, SCS. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Uh, sneak peek at what? My dog, you know what she looks like. She got her hair cut. It's very cute. Um, oh, Echo Spire. Err, uh, yeah, nothing wrong with being a square every once in a while. Uh, yeah, I've got little fruit flies. There's one. There's one. There's, oh, there's one. And they laid a trap out, and I think they're too clever for it. Which means just one at a time. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, Feel free to go sub to the Twitch. And guys, if you are on Twitch, they have a YouTube channel you can sub to as well. Go get, get those numbers up. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, so, oh, hello. Uh, two new names, Homer, Homer and Casey and Chaos. I like Casey and Chaos. That's a cool, that's a cool username. I like it a lot. Uh, wow, two chats is ambitious already. Um, I also have to have oh, my new monitor comes on Monday. The HDMI cable has already arrived. Monday I'm going to have a brand new monitor, so that'll make life a lot easier as well. Um, I am going to try and figure out what kind of theme I want to have set up so it will be the same every single time. Or I'll get unique Geek Bomb ones. That'd be kind of cool too. Lots to do whilst long. <coughs> hey. Do we mind? Zelda's been a very good guard dog. If anyone rings the bell, because someone obviously dropped off a package, Zell's straight there, aren't you, Bob? Zelda just woke up. Oh, you woke up someone else's dog. Zelda, we've got to not do that, Bubba. Off you hop. I kind of want to check to see if my monitor has arrived, but I'll watch you. You want to You should say. All right. Strap a GoPro on Zelda and stream it. She would hate that. Um, all right, I have a walk through in front of me as well in case I need it because this game, I cannot save it. I can't get anything wrong. If I get anything wrong, we either have to start all over again or we just call it a night. Yikes. Uh, and Zachary says, I'm watching Funders and Flagons to make myself feel better after hearing about Chadwick. Man, that was devastating, huh? That's so sad to hear. Uh, Jaded Cats just followed. Zachary just followed. Tokistan has just followed. That's cool. Uh, if you're on the YouTube, bzz, watching and commenting on Twitch and YouTube at the same time is cool, says Garth. Party on, Garth. 
Um, alrighty. I'm very, very nervous to get into the game. I'm going to play it so that... Oh, no, no, no. I want to still be able to see chat. Why won't you let me? When I have two monitors, this will be so much better. Okay, I can still see. There it is. Hello, Waco kid. There's Casey and Chaos. I wish I had half the work ethic. How many plates am I spinning? I've run out of hands. I'll run out of plates. That's why we have a dishwasher. Alrighty, um, I just want to quickly read over the walkthrough. I feel like I, I know it, but basically uh, I've just gotten the million dollar bill. Now what I did last time is that I went and bought a big gulp. And she's like, we can't, well, you think I can break a million dollar note? And I'm like, fuck, and I can't leave the store. So I got shot. Um, oh, so there's gotta be a square count, I apologize. So I have to go to this bougie, bougie boutique and get change for my million dollar note. Alrighty, okay, I'm back. Okay, I'm back. Okay, I'm back. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Oh, and who's this woman? Okay. Uh, and I read a bit of a walkthrough and didn't realize that there's like other things that I wasn't doing um, to get extra points. Oh, I think I just go down from here. Yeah, see? This is the bougie one. Oh my gosh, the speed just goes, there's bursts of speed. I don't need it to be that fast. Um, say hello. Hi. Great. Um, kick out swimsuit. There are swimsuits for sale on the rack of the rear of the store. Let's do that. That makes sense. Pick out swimsuit. Oh, wait, my headphones. I don't know if I want them. You select a reasonably tight spandex job in blue. Although it's a little tight. Perhaps that may work to your advantage on the ship. In fact, this may be the beginning of a whole new image for you, Larry. Alrighty, now I'm gonna go pay for it. Pay for swimsuit. I'm sorry, says the dark-haired Italian beauty. I'm only allowed to accept purchases at the front of the freaking counter. Pay for swimsuit. Excuse me, miss, you say hesitantly. Do you have change for a million? Bella bueno, she smiles, but of course, but that's, uh, but is that trivial little clearance item all you're going to purchase today? Uh, yes, ma'am, you reply, handing over your lottery winnings. I've only got a million on me. <laughs> that's tongue in cheek, guys. Alrighty, that will be $106,500, including, uh, but including tax. Your change is $893,500. That's 100, 200. $300, $400, Stop! Don't count anymore, you shout. I don't have that long before my ship leaves. Very well, have a nice day. How did you know she was gonna say that? You pocket your new giant wad of $100 bills. Alrighty, F5 is pause. Oh, that's to save. I don't have that. Can't save this game. Nope, I tried. See, I tried. Can't do it. Don't have a floppy. What's pause? Control P? Okay. <sighs> right. I'm so nervous about getting this wrong. I don't want to I don't want to go through it again. I don't want to fail. All right. So apparently I have to wait until a jogger appears on the path in the background and say, "Look, jogger." That's pervy. But that's Larry. All righty. Jogger in the background. Jogger in the background. Jogger in the background. I don't see no jogger in the background. Hmm. Oh, south. That makes sense. Jogger in the background. This thing gets really fast. Oh, there's jogger. Look at jogger. Hey, 
Hey, I don't think I've ever unlocked that point before in my life. Now I'm a schlemiel. 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 Uh, am I still going fast? Yeah, that's too fast. Look how fast he's going. Um, control. Nope, that's not doing it. Function. That feels like it's... Okay. Uh, Astro Boy. God, this game. Yeah, it's beginning, huh? My Jewish accent could use some work. Well, uh, yeah, okay. Um, <laughs> clearly not. Uh, walk over to trash and get passport. And that's after going west and south. Great. Uh-huh. All right, so now if you guys joined the first one, the bins weren't here. And now there is pick up passport. Pour it. Okay. You now smell like a combination of cheap department store credit card bills and roadkill. Kill. Uh, we want to go to get a haircut now. Such a weird little game. Hi, ACTC8. Alrighty. We are getting a haircut. Oui, monsieur, but of course, replies the barber. Allow me to correct that receding hairline of yours with my patented special proprietary technique. <gasps> Macrobiotic styling reweaving. Just have a seat in the chair, please. Uh, please don't look at the portraits hanging in this hair salon as if any reputable place. Maybe that's what I'm, they're trying to say. Here, says the barber. Take a look in the mirror and remember what you look like. When I'm done, you won't be able to recognize your own hairline. Wow, you'll be a different man. Ew, not an attractive man. Not. That's a receding hairline. You think to yourself, yeah, that's exactly what I need. A new look. I'll make Bachelorette Barbie change her too. Okay, go for it, you tell the barber. Uh, allow me to begin with a thorough cleansing to rich your hair and scalp of any possible pollutants, says the barber. I assure you, I only use the trendiest products, all organically grown and available in undersized, overpriced, biodegradable bottles. The colors are just insane. But yeah, like mermaid and boobs. Yeah, right? Uh, you wonder to yourself, what will I look like when he's done? Will I be handsome? Will I ever find true love? You're a nimrod, so. That's what he thinks he's gonna look like. That's what he thinks he's gonna do. You certainly have interesting daydreams, says the barber. Oi. There's a cat peeing. Brutus, get out of here. Your hair is clean and conditioned, said the barber. Now for the special styling. However, in the future, may I recommend a 10 W40 and no more than 3,000 miles between oil changes. Oh, it's trying to be funny. It's a car joke, but it's hair. <laughs> we can speed this process up, surely. All done, says the barber. Take a look in the mirror. What do you think? It's exactly the same. See you later, Jenny. Oh, you can't judge a book by its cover. That'll be fine, you tell the barber. Say, you ask him, exactly how could I know I was getting a micro macrobiotic styling? By the price. That'll be a hundred bucks, says the barber. Thanks, I guess, you say flipping the barber one of your C notes. The Barbara, Barbara. Barber replies, have a nice day. Oh, why is it going so slow now? What? Okay, I've got to figure out this speed up and speed down. Alt? Got it. Boom, now she's in action. Who would pay that much for hair? Mm -hmm. You're talking the wrong person. Um, okay. Gotta go up. Up again. And then this way, I gotta get some sunscreen. So if you don't, if you forget one of these, 
things, you can't get progress through the story. Alrighty, so I want to get, I think it's from here. You grab a bottle of SPF 90 while you picture a bachelorette barber rubbing it all over you. Alrighty, you gotta go pay for it. Pay for sunscreen. I'd like to pay for this, you tell the clerk. Do you have change for 100? No, but, be, uh, but feel free to give me a big tip. But of course, my good man, you tell him suddenly putting on airs. Have a hundred. In fact, have two. Money means nothing to me. <laughs> like, thanks, dude, he tells you. Now let me get back to sleep. He concludes with, have a nice day. Now you're a dullard. Um, now we want to... Oh, now we want to go get the big gulp. So we got to go up one. So this is where I stuffed up last time. Oh, silly girl, I got so excited. I was like, I think I have to buy a big gulp. There's an order. Uh, buy, oh, fill cup. Okay. So you've seen this before if you did the first one. A cup that long might take a long time to fill up. A cup that big. A cup that large might take forever to fill. Finally, you top it off while you carefully consider how you're going to pick it up. Ah, oh, shucks, this isn't real life, but merely an incredible simulation. You decide to put it in your pocket along with everything else. So now we got to pay for it. Pay. Here's a hundred dollar bill you offer. Okay, partner. Too bad we don't keep change at this time of night, but it's broad daylight, you protest. Have a nice day, she concludes. Now you're a schmuck. Um, and then... Uh, west, 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 south. Oh, now we've got to go to the music shop. I don't know why. This never really made sense, but you've got to do something for the KGB to want to follow you. The story. Hello, new people. Actually, really quickly, I just want to... Oh, I can't. I can't. Say, look, the store is finally open for business. I think that's the exit only. Oh, it's so finicky. There we go. Um, come on, in you go. Alrighty. Talk to a woman. Hi, beautiful. You attempt to lay a little smooth mouth on the lady, Latin, lovely Latin lady. My name is Larry, Larry Laffer. Buenos dias, senor dos asistanta bella bona. Oh, I've got no idea. Good day, sir. How may I help you? Suddenly, she smiles broadly as if she recognizes you. Her smile makes you glad you took Spanish in high school. Too bad you slept through it. Oh, what the heck? You decide to brush the dust off your Spanish by attempting a conversation with the lovely senorita. Perhaps you could begin by complimenting her on her extremely good looks. Uh, your ears remind me of whale breasts. <laughs> Her face brightens further. She seems genuinely interested in you. Your Spanish must be not so bad after all. Uh, yes, but the moon is full and you are a chihuahua. <laughs> These are code names, by the way. Whoa, speaking is one thing, but understanding is another. Her response baffles you completely. You have no idea what she means. Of course, that's never stopped you before. My pencil is long, hard, and yellow. Of course, I'm playing with Irish suit, Larry. Uh, so you're finally here. I thought you'd never show up. By the way, who writes these secret phrases anyway? The microfiche containing the secrets to the recent United States Superconductor Research Breakthrough is hidden inside this rare Peruvian onclunk. Don't let anyone touch it before you personally deliver it to Dr. Nanuki. And, I don't need to tell you, be careful. He and he alone has the authority to deliver it to the USSR agents. Thanks, I guess. As best you can tell, she wants to keep that unusual musical instrument on the counter. So rather than risk offending her, you... you you take it. Now you're a bore. Have a nice day. All right, so now that's a KBGB agent after after you say, what an interesting car. You think to yourself, how does he make it do that? You were so distracted by the low rider that you failed and uh, noticed the unusually unusual little man lurking beside the car. How He, however, doesn't fail to notice you. The little guy in the trench coat gives you a short head start, then follows you. Larry, be careful. This guy's up to no good. Before we, 
<laughs> um, oh, okay, I just keep, I walk east, south, and then east and arrive at the harbor. Cool. This is progressing at a very quick rate, guys. Eee, look at his little tiny legs. Genlock 36. Whoa, let's do Larry. This takes a few decades. Wait a minute, what's this? How can you be at the door to the music store when you just walked off the screen to the right? That's because this is really the agent. That must be someone who looks just like you. Something strange is going on here. Let's follow him into the music shop and see what we can learn. You, what are you doing back here? Says the clerk, skipping the foreign language subtitles completely. You'd better get on with the mission before Dr. Nanuki prevents you from ever missioning again. What are you talking about? I've never seen you before in my entire life, says the dorky looking guy. Besides, you're not supposed to talk to me like that before we exchange our cute little secret phrases. What do you mean? She responds, you just walked out that door over there. Not me, he exclaims. Hey, wait a minute. Don't tell me you gave the goods to someone else. Uh, 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 she stammers. That's so loud. That is, then maybe I may have. Her voice trembles with fear. I'm sorry, he fit your description perfectly, and he said the secret code phrases as well. Although it comes to think of it, come to think of it, he did have a terrible accent. Or I thought the bad accent might have been part of your disguise. What will I do? She continues. Mr. Nanuki doesn't tolerate mistakes. Her eyes flash with an idea. Of course, if you promise to help me, I won't tell him how how you lost the micro sheesh. Why you, he threatens. If you know what's good for you, you'll shut down this joint. Contact Nontunite. <laughs> Island and get the troops started finding this guy. They'll guarantee he has uh, he tells no tales about your little indiscretion. They'll guarantee he tells no. Yep. If you can retrieve the micro fish before he discovers what he has, Dr. Nanuki may even allow you to live a few extra days. She deliberates just a moment before making her decision. You're right, of course. You see if you can follow him while I contact the island by radio telephone. Well, Larry, this is certainly another fine mess you've gotten us into. Not only is the KGB after you for grabbing what was supposed to be theirs, but Dr. Nanuki's beautiful army of henchettes, game show hostesses, church secretaries, and bimbos is now hot on your tail. Ah, now hot on your tail. That's grammatically incorrect. Since we've now learnt the worst, we'll rejoin you as you wander through Los Angeles. Which is so weird because I'm in Los Angeles. Um, but we want to go... Eek! Hey, Sonny, said the old man. Would you like to hit of the bird? That's a no. Get the truck out of there. He's a bad guy. He'll kill you. Trust me, I've tried him all. And watch the bird will poop. Show man ticket. Hey, you tell the person. Here's my ticket and passport. Okay, let's say you just made it. Let's look at that passport first. Hmm, <laughs> nice photo, he says sarcastically. Now let's see if your ticket is in order. Ah, oh, jeez, another freebie. One of those suits in marketing gonna realize these boats don't sail on wind power anymore. Oops, I'm sorry, it's not your fault. Regaining his composure, he continues. Your cabin will be on deck F, cabin number one. That'll be all the way below decks to the rear. This will give you an excellent opportunity to hear all the subtle inflections of our diesels. You may now enter, he concludes. Honestly, this is like reading this for the first time because I did not. What? How do you say microfish with the F I C H E? Oh yeah, and those those noises are so loud. Sorry, they don't happen too often, but when they do, yeah, don't you recognize this? Oh, so he's dreaming about his love. find love or you keep looking in all the wrong places so when I was a kid playing this all I would do is just try to I'd point at the screen to predict where the little glistening parts were gonna be that's all didn't understand most of it Jono haven't seen his game in forever uh, all computer game sounds I am half nostalgic and half deaf so great gravel digger that's quite Alrighty, now we are on the cruise ship. I believe the first thing that I'm supposed to do is to go into my cabin. On the map, walk to the bottom right corner of the ship to enter the cabin. Open door at the right side of the cabin to meet Barb's mother. Ooh, that's here. 
Because Barb obviously didn't uh, want to go on this cruise, so she sent, gave it to her mum instead. Oh, okay, this is what's... When it's too fast... When he walks too fast, you can't... Oh, my God. I'm going to have to slow it right down. No, I've forgotten how to slow it down again. Ah. Alrighty, we meet Bob. His first mama. Well, 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 what are we here? Says the woman on the bed. Uh oh, Larry, you've been caught entering someone else's stateroom. Why, I do you believe it's the darling young man that my daughter won on TV? Says the woman. Good lord, she's bachelor at Barbara's mother. Poor little Barbie got to feeling poorly just as the cruise was about to start, so I decided to borrow her ticket and come along instead. Your mind quickly envisions paradise lost. I hope you don't mind, I convinced the purser that it was in his best interest to assign us adjoining cabins. I'm sure I can make your voyage enjoyable. The mum's cracking onto him. I really want to get to know you if you get my drift. After I saw you win the lottery show, I thought that you were just about the cutest thing I'd ever seen. <laughs> Except for my mister, of course, may he rest in peace. He was a good man and usually quite sturdy, but one day uh, his heart just couldn't take it anymore. You wonder why it's necessary for you to learn this. Honey, anytime you want to come over and see Mama, just feel to, uh, free to pop on through that doorway, you hear? She attempts to give you a cute girlish smile. She fails. Eek. Closed door. Closed door. Great. Um, uh, pause. Because there's so many things where if you enter somewhere too many times or if you don't do one thing, it's over. And I don't want that. Um, oh. Exit and enter the cabin to find that she's gone. Oh, right. That's right. Okay, I'm back. Open door. She should be gone. Okay, cool. Not this time. So, oh, she has a sewing kit in here. Get kit. Open drawer, okay, get kit, okay, close drawer, okay, great, close door, oh, damn it. close door, close door, cool, now what do I have to do? Oh, I gotta get the fruit here. Get fruit. Okay. Um, and then walk behind the closet and change into swimsuit. Okay, this is a good place to change out of clothes. He likes his privacy. Exit the cabin. And then we want to arrive at the pool. This is what's gonna be hard. Okay, nah. Okay. Nah. I'm going to have to slow it down because I have to go oh no I have to go up the stairs like literally up the stairs like up control doesn't do it alt doesn't do it how do I slow down function function there we go and even see how it says pluses and minuses on the ship I realized that that was like a, a hint. Cute little cruise ship there, huh? There we go. So the pool deck is here. You know what? I think this is a good speed. We don't want to go too fast. Okay, first thing we want to do is use sunscreen because this guy burns. Okay, you carefully rub the sunscreen over every part of your body. You want to lie down, get those points. Um, I'm pretty sure straight away you just get up, uh, walk into the pool, swim and dive. Uh-oh. 
What? What's happening? Get out. Uh oh. Not now, there's someone coming. Did I wait too long? Or did this have to happen? She's bait. She works for the KGB, so you can't leave until you've gotten something. Why, hello there, big fella, says the beautiful blonde with the body like a brick shipyard. <laughs> Why are you hanging around here? I've been looking for someone just like you for a long time. Why don't you come back to my place and you won't have to hang around all alone ever again? Jeez, Larry, you finally found yourself a live one. Um, come on, Samson. I just can't wait to get you all alone. She is the one that ties you down and lasers you from the middle of your legs up. Not cool. All right, dive. So this one, if you don't tell him to swim, he won't. Swim. Okay, dive. Oh, God. Guy's a bit pathetic, isn't he? Dive. Dive. Okay. Alrighty, so you want him to go all the way down and then because if you take too long you'll die so I'm gonna say get bikini top because that's what it is You're not close enough all right so I'll keep going down and then press it no go down get bikini top Christ, I don't want to die. Come on, swim up. <laughs> Please, swim faster, dude. Did I make it? Please. Okay, I made it. Oh, God, guys, this is intense. <laughs> All right. Um... On the map, walk to the bottom right corner of the ship. I have to use sunscreen again? Oh, because it washes off, I guess you get bonus points. Alrighty. And then next we go to the restaurant. Uh, okay. Get, get out. Put on the sunscreen. You are clever to reapply the sunscreen after you swam and washed it off. That was refreshing. And then I think I get out of here. So slow, but it needs to happen. The stairs are hard. Um, what's everyone saying? I think the restaurant is all the way through. Yay, I managed the stairs pretty well that time. What's YouTube saying? Fish. And we're going down into the cabin. If you go into the cabin more than like three times, the mum tries to chill, dominate, dominatrix you and whip you. I wish I was joking. Uh, night has fallen on the good ship USS Love Tub, so head for your bed. No, I don't want to head to the bed. No. How was I too long? I need to get to the restaurant. Uh-uh. Please don't. Oh, no. How, what did I do wrong? <laughs> Suddenly a deep rumbling shakes your cabin, not the steady roar of the ship's engines to which you've now grown accustomed. This sounds more like an onrushing steam locomotive encountering a deep gradient while the fireman pours on the coals. See, it's mama. Oh no, what is she doing? Oops, says big mother. I literally, I didn't mean to hurt you little fella. Shoo, she says in such a cute and too, uh, he was such a cute and too, she moans. Now it's become clear to you, you must escape from this vessel before darkness falls or you'll continue to be the main course of Mama's party. I didn't, I, I have a walkthrough in front of me. I don't, I can't stay, I have to restart. That's so annoying. What did I do that took so long? I went in there. I saw her, went out, grabbed the sewing kit. Yeah, she killed me. Got the fruit, 
went to the pool. I didn't even mess around. I didn't go anywhere else. Was it because I took too long going up the stairs? I lay, I did every, I did everything right. Do you guys want to, what, what should I do now? Should I keep playing it? I feel like we've done this before. I guess we could do it fast. Get money. Oh, I want to put this on fast. This is some bullshit, people. I just don't know what, I mean, if there was like something obvious that I'd done. I mean, doctor, I've already, I've got, I've got the walkthrough in front of me. I did everything right. I have no idea why night already fell. That makes no sense. Wait, I need to go. Stop it. Now you're going too fast, Larry. Larry Laffer. Yeah, I can't save. I can't save because I don't have a floppy disk. It won't let me. Where's the drop? Where's the... I can't find the thing. Maybe we'll do another game. I like that it says Hollywood in the clouds, though. <gasps> Look, hole. Now I'm a schmuck again. Don't do that. Oh my god, I'm going too fast. I just need to go in here. Buy lottery ticket. <sighs> I've just done all this as well. One, one, one. Two, two, two. Three, three, three. Four, four, four. These are irrelevant. Five, 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 six, six, six. <sighs> we can get through this really quickly. I don't know what else to do on the cruise though. You go in there, you meet her, you leave, you go back in, you get the sewing kit, you get changed, you get the fruit. Show ticket. All right, we need to write these down. Uh, 703, 783. Nine nine seven two nine six six four eight eight two four. What six numbers do you have? Seven oh three seven eight three nine nine seven two nine six six four four eight eight two four. Cool, you won. So you go into the green room. Don't get nervous just because you're on live television and being watched by millions of people. She chuckles under her breath. Going in, you sit. Let's get that speed up. Okay, that's as fast as we can go. Alrighty, basically this is the producer saying, hurry up, we've been waiting for you. Come on, aim. Never get it right the first time. Alrighty, so now I'm on this dating show. <sighs> this doesn't look like the lottery show. I'm going to probably skip this a little bit more, guys. I'll just paraphrase because we already did this the first time. Uh, alrighty, this is the new dating show. Here's your host, Biff Barr. Thank you. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Dating Connection. This is uh, Barbara, our person trying to get the dates. There's bachelor number one, David Blair. Is he a magician? Bachelor number two is the wrong person. Uh, excuse me, my name is Larry, Larry Leffer. I don't care. And number three is a dickwad. Uh, it's time to play Dating Connection. Barbara, we have your first question. It's gross. 
Um, what kind of first date would they have? That's uh, something really conceited and awful. Uh, gross number when you're with me. Oh, thank you, Gravel Digger. When climbing down the stairs this time, use the end key to walk diagonally down them. End key? End key? I don't have an end key. I'm on a... I don't have an end key. Hold on, I'm getting tips over in the YouTube chat. End key. Pause. Pause. Oh, increase and decrease your walking speed to decrease the time spent between scenes. Oh, that's a really good idea. I'm going to have to do it super slow, huh? Um... Yeah, you can't save on the hard drive on this emulator. Stairs this time, use the end key to walk diagonally down them. Now, hopefully, when you return to the cabin, Larry will still stand awaiting the next command. Appears that nighttime has fallen, then Larry has not been quick enough arriving on the ship. <sighs> yeah. Okay. Uh, alrighty, we've got to say what the date will be like. What kind of date? A date is a date. <laughs> she doesn't like it. It doesn't matter what you say. She doesn't like it. She's like, yeah, you're the worst. You're the worst. Um... How about you, Bachelor number three? Oh, uh, yeah, right? Okay. Oh, I'll pick you up in my really cool car and tell you how hot you are and what I want to do with you. Oh, that sounds lovely. No, no. This pack has lasted a while, all things considered. You may be Bachelor number three on this program, but you're number one in my heart. Ugh. Hold on, so I've got to go fast, not slow. Hmm. Gravel digger, I need more information. All right, she's asked for the next question. What flower would she be and what insect would they be? And it's as nauseating as you think it is, guys. Was there a nerd bingo? Sugar break bingo? Nom, nom, nom. Oh yeah, I won. I won. Oh no, shit. What flower? <laughs> she hates it. He just says something super inappropriate and she loves it. Gross. There's some pretty funny commentary from him though. Uh oh. I didn't know makeup. This is where it gets interesting, though. She's saying that two of the men are pretty tough to choose from. And he said, yes, but I'm sure the audience has already made its decision. And she says, yes, and I've made my decision, you know, too. Two. We just won the dating show. Look at his face, he's so happy. This is how you win the cruise. Ooh. Spent a month on this cruise, Nana. Damn, she waits until the first night to jump your bones and flatten you into a piece of cardboard. Mm. Alrighty, you won a cruise. Let's continue on. Even the producer is annoyed at you. Like, here, yeah, the producer's like, fuck you. Here's your cruise ship ticket, you're me. 
Alrighty, so he's, she's saying you'll need luck, but I'm about to win a million dollars. Well, a million dollar note. Hi, Patrick. Gotta go fast. Okay. Come on. Cries a woman, where have you been? I just want a dating show. I don't care. No, didn't make it the first time. Alrighty, it's the same host, but it's not. But we are uh, run out of time. We just gotta go and spin the wheel. Spoiler, I win. <laughs> Action square is good. Call Trish to help. Patrick? Let's have a look. Right. <clears throat> I can't see anything tweeted. Did you tweet it to Geekbomb or me? I'll have a look. Oh. No, I see nothing. That one got me just a little bit. You did not, Patrick. You did not. Alrighty. Now I've got to buy it. Now we're pretty much up to where we left off. So we're going to do all that same crap again. Nope, nope, nope. Down here? Yeah. Doors. Doors, doors will be the death of me. Far out. Ha ha ha. Alrighty. Pick out swim suit. Pay. No one can, you can't tweet my DMs, bud. We're getting through all this again. If you've just joined us, we're doing exactly the same thing that we were doing at the start of the stream because uh, I somehow fucked up and uh, life's not, that's not good. And now I gotta wait for the jogger. Where are you? the joker. Oh, fuck. Joker. 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 You can barely even see him. Damn. Alrighty, haircut again. DM Geek Bomb. Cool, cool. Ah! Hold on, Christian or Patrick? Which one? Which one? Oh, you made a Geek Bomb subreddit. We've only got a Maud subreddit, a Maud Garrett subreddit. But yeah, I guess we didn't have a Geek Bomb subreddit, so that's cool. Oh, wow, there's quite 
quite a few DMs that I have absolutely never seen. Yeah. There's a lot of... I didn't know that there were so many in there. Good to know. Okay. Cat peeing. getting a message. Hmm. Um, we have been having a problem with an ex-community member. That was just Rachel Hine updating me on the situation. That's really unfortunate. All right. Oh, this bloody haircut. So basically, he wins all this money and then everyone takes advantage of him. Yeah, Zelda, she just got her nails trimmed as well when she got her haircut. But so what happens when you have floorboards? I have bought a lot of carpet. I need a little more. All right. Come on. Um, Joshua, I know how you did the rising lights, rise up lights. That's what it really is. I was wondering if you can do an American accent and then say rising lights. What's rise up lights? In an American accent? Rise up lights. Alrighty, let's buy some things, eh? We gotta buy the sunscreen. We gotta buy the big gulp. This puck fucking punk is gonna walk away with $200 and steal a bad attitude. Getting jaded at this stage. Rise up lights. Mm -hmm. Ken sent you, says the RCD. Really? That's wonderful. That's wonderful. Is this what LA really looks like or did back then? Uh, oh, the gulp, the bloody gulp. Phil, <laughs> the heck you say? <laughs> there you go. Um, hi, little girl. Zelda's just down there. Oh, I gotta pay for it. Oh, I nearly didn't. I nearly didn't. All right. Um, I think I gotta pick up the passport now. What is this, Stephen? Stephen! He is encouraging me to continue streaming. I appreciate that and I appreciate you. That's so lovely. You've been such a good supporter for so long too. Talk to a woman. 
Alrighty, again, for those that are just tuning in, this woman is an actual KGB agent. She does all of the high cheese shuffles, um, does all of the codes, like, you know, the eagle landed at midnight, but it's in Spanish and he's getting it all right. And so she gives him this um, uh, top secret instrument, which has all the KGB secrets or like the secrets in it. And uh, it's the wrong person. And so now I'm getting, now I'm getting, yeah, did, Stephen, didn't you also donate when I did the um, book reading for Star Wars? That's sweet. Hello, Short Pockets. It's nice to see more doing more things, says Insane Raven. You know what would be really cool if I can just get through this cruise part? Because honestly, anything past the cruise, I don't think I want to start from scratch again. I'm just not masochistic enough, you know? We can skip through all this, and we realize that this is the real dude she was supposed to give it to. And they're like, oh, you done fucked up. Skip. Skip. Oh my god, Nathan, I'm seeing you tweet on, comment on both. And Adam. <laughs> Did I get the passport? Shoot, I didn't get the passport. Oh no. Does that mean the dude's gonna find me? Because I should have got the passport first. Guys, we're on the cruise again. Oh, my friend's trying to FaceTime me. Alrighty, so one more time, gravel. I'm supposed to do this on, I'm supposed to do it fast. I'm supposed to slow down, then speed up, then slow down, then speed up. I thought going fast would be worse. Hi, Jonathan. Um, I think we're all good for the moment. Thanks, Patrick Sash Christian. Mallory, did you know you have a fan page subreddit? I do, Maud Garrett's been going for a little while now, actually. And this note goes for ages. Yum. Hi, baby. Jordan, how many times? Shit! guys panic stages panic stages this is just go 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 I gotta get through doors is this it is that it okay and then she's gone great oh fuck it says if I leave oh no it says if I leave and then walk back in she's gone she's not gone this is bad information. This walkthrough has no like, it sounds too, oh my God, she threw me on the fucking bed. Now you just get comfortable in these chromium chains and handcuffs while I slip and something more comfortable. Now you can see why this broad's a widow. <sighs> Quit. Oh, that sucks. Um, alrighty, now it becomes the part where 
we play another retro game from the early 90s. I will take suggestions. Whilst being devastated. Yeah, but when you play that as a kid, you just don't really get it. You know, you kind of, ex you just kind of accept things. You don't really need the meaning behind it and don't really understand it. It's kind of like, okay, okay. That's just so annoying though. I'll try and get to the cruise again. And then when I get to the um, pool after I get the bikini, I'll, or when I get to the cruise, I'll try again. Uh, go for Oregon Trail. Oregon Trail. Alrighty. Alrighty. Oregon. Excuse me. Why won't it? Oregano. Why isn't that working? Oregon Trail. Am I spelling it right? Am I spelling it wrong? How is everyone spelling it? Space Quest? Oregon. That's because it's Oregon Trail. Maud. Don't think I've ever spelled Oregon before. Uh, Alan O'Allen oh, says, what's the problem with saving? The Because it's an emulator, it only sort of recognizes the, the game format. So when it asks you to save, it's like, all right, now insert the floppy disk that you want to save the data onto. You can't do it. So you're kind of stuck. Um, what the... CD-ROM, MS-DOS. Here we go. Oregon Trail, the Oregon. There you go. There's uh, just for people who haven't seen it before. Let's go through a couple. This is all the MS DOS games that I used to play back in the day. Um, Prince of Persia is always a good one. Wolfenstein 3D is fun. Um, there's still a couple that I we played. Where is Carmen San Diego? That was fun. Golden Eye, Golden Axe. Sorry, Golden Axe. We tried and it's glitched, bugged out. We can't get into the game. I used to play Centurion Defender of Rome and I didn't understand how to play it, but I really liked it. <laughs> Go figure. Um, there's a couple of games I really want. Like there was a racing car game, but like in the Alley Cat sort of like era where you only had like those 16 bit colors. Like Double Dragon right there. That's amazing. Ski or Die, I really want to play. I actually think I'll do it now. This game is awesome it's so whack ski or die and then i'll play some oregon trail and then we'll call it an afternoon oh, shred dude my god he's bringing me back all righty um let's go compete come on is the is it not registering oh no you can't use the mouse you can only use the arrows to go around um, far out. You know what? We'll practice. It's been a hot minute. Um, oh, no, it's inverse as well. Right is left and left is right. Oh, that's going to suck so hard. Why? And there's no forward. Can't go for. Let me scroll to see if there's. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm just trying to find. Uh, I'm trying to find. Yeah, I don't know. I can. How do I go forward? Control, shift, enter, enter. Alrighty. Okay. Th that's hard. Alright. I'm up against Lester. Oh. Okay, I think I, I got a knot. Oh, you know, the pump's good. The band aid's good. Damn it. That's not, and I got it. Great, cool. I've got no points so far. Wait. They are points. I can't believe I can remember the... Oh, this is the wrong side. We wanted to go the other one. Oh, 
Uh oh. I can't believe I remember the music. I'm beating this guy, but his points are so good. Oh no, I ate it. So did he. Go, go, go. Oh, and he got flat. Go, go. This is embarrassing. Yeah, the soundtrack for this one's not great. And there's like some guy and he's like guitar, like trying to get through it and he sucks. Damn it. No. Well, I mean, I finished first, but you got higher, more points. Oh, I won still. Boom. Nope. One and done for that one, I should think. Ah, uh, Snowball Blast was fun. Uh, enter to move. Oh. Little shit. Oh no. Oh. Haha. <laughs> Do I want this one? No. Was that a yes or a no? Oh. Oh, that gives you more snowballs. Not bad, Garrett. Not bad. Rolls out of the way? Oh, I'm in the gaming zone again. Hey. Hey. That little guy at the front is a punk. Tight. Got him. That one at the front, I hate him. Got him. Some more snowballs. I have 177. I think I'm doing okay. Felt nice. I'm in the zone, people. Hello. Oh my god. Oh my god, I've just realized. No wonder I'm not doing so well. Um I'm only facing north. I'm supposed to I'm supposed to face different directions. Can you see how it says north, west, east, west? I don't know how to I don't know how to change direction. I'm getting owned because I'm only facing one way. How do I face the other way? East? No. Can't do it. Oh my god. So I'm supposed to be east right now to get that one. And I can't. <laughs> I don't know how to... It's that time in the stream on a retro game where I have to... Ooh! Press every button to try and figure out what does what. Oh, I've somehow gotten out of the game. Oh, man. 
press the wrong button. Cool, well, that was fun. <laughs> Oregon Trail. Oh, I can't, I can't do anything in here. that in music anymore. Oh, I'm just getting used to the new, this one was my favorite. This one was my favorite. Alrighty. So you have to hold it down and then do tricks. Okay. Oh, great. Okay. Uh, I'd like to try and remember how to do a flip, but I, I can't remember. Downhill blitz. All right, here we go. What's jump? Oh, I did it. Five points for doing my little jump. Oh, you can't turn but nearly as well as I'd hoped. That's fine. Ooh. Oh, a couple little points. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Dun -dun -dun. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. this one being as hard when I was a kid. Oh crap. But there's obviously like an easier track. 208. I'll take it. No. Um, wait, snowboard half pipe. It's my last one. Oh, this one. Shreds, man. Wait. Wait, what's jump? I thought that was jump. What's jump then? Oh, that was it? I'm not, I'm not able to jump anymore. Wait, how come it jumps sometimes? good. The bunnies are bad. But you should also be able to like jump up here too. Oh. supposed to be going um, up here and jumping there. 
and landing it, but I, I, can't, I obviously can't do that. Cool, so that was not good. Alrighty. That was fun. Aura, aura, oh, come on. Oh, okay. Let's look up MS DOS again. And Oregon Trail. Now, it's been a hot second for this one, people. It's been a hot second. 1990. Travel the trail. I'll go banker. Alrighty, who's up? Give me them bits or emojis or thingos. I want to see who's going to be on my team. I have four places. Oh, wait, moved game capture. That better? Yeah. What names have we got here? Yes, Andrew on YouTube. I eat nerds. Hi, Kevin. Alrighty, I fixed the screen. Oh, Fo, I tried to flip. I really did. I tried to flip it. I didn't do so well. Whoa, is that even better or worse? That looks worse. I have to check. Oh, it's full screen now. Full screen though means I can't. Sam? Nathan wants to be on there. Adam wants to be on there. Are we doing a lewd suggestion? Do you know me? Zelda. Adam. Siam. <laughs> Whoa, big mod. Bruce, YouTube anything? Mard, Bruce, are these names correct? Yes. It is 1848. You're jumping off place for Oregon is Independence, Missouri. You must decide which month to leave Independence. Ask for advice. You attend a public meeting held for folks with the California Oregon fever, you're told. If you leave too early, there won't be any grass for your oxen to eat. If you leave too late, you might not get to Oregon before winter comes. If you leave at just the right time. All right. If you leave too early, if you leave too... So March, right? March? March? I'll wait. May? April or May? I want both. One. Three. Two. What? 
200 pounds for each person. Mm -hmm. Warm clothes, two sets of clothes per person. Okay. Ammunition. 20 bullets. 100 bullets. No, 10 bullets. Four. Oh, how many boxes do I want? All right. Uh, spare parts. Two wagon wheels. Two, two. All right, I got money left over. Let's make, let's get more of them. Oh, I can only carry three. There you go. All righty. Here we go. Weather is cool, health is good, pace is steady, rations filling. Alrighty, continue on trail, check supplies, look at map, change pace, change food rations, stop to rest, attempt to trade, talk to people, buy supplies. Let's continue on that trail, people. Uh-oh, what's this, what's this thing? What's this, a river? Press spacebar to size up the situation. Would you like to look around? Yes. Oh. Hello, Aw, Sid. Thank you. Alright, that was lovely. Um, look on map. Oh, we have a long way to go. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Change the pace. Let's crack it a bit. Let's do a strenuous pace for a bit. Continue on that trail. You must cross the river in order to continue the river. Uh, this point is currently 624 feet across. Yikes. Um, guys, what? Attempt to ford the river? No. Cork the wagon and float it across? No. Take a ferry across? Yes. Charge you five dollars and that you'll have to wait five days. Are you willing to do this? Yes. What else are we going to do? There we go. Oh, that's so cute. It's not a ferry, that's a raft, but okay. Um, so McDuck said, did I miss Leisure Suit Larry? Yeah, I died twice. Twice. Another river? Golly. Adam has a snake bite. Adam! Why didn't you move? <laughs> a thief stole 22 bullets. Yes. Okay. Continue on the trail. It's only 2.8 feet deep. We can cross that. One. There we go. That's fine. That's fine. Everything's fine. What? What did it just say? It went too fast. What did it, I'm going to look at the replay. <gasps> Hello, Nikki Revolte. So lovely to hear from you. Um, what just flashed up? I'm just trying to see. Hi, Alex. Oh, not too fast. Too fast. That's okay. What is this? Next landmark. Weather's warm. Health is good. Adam's got a snake bite. We're at Fort Kearney. Cool. Um... Talk to people. The game is still plentiful along here, but getting harder to find. So many o overlanders, I don't expect it to last more than a few years. Folks, shoot the game for sport. Take a small piece and let the rest rot in the sun. Gross. Just get, get, get the truck out of here. We're not here to make friends. We gotta just go. Just go. You're all having. Take me to the doctor, please. No, you're fine. Nikki asked how he is. Um, 
She's hungry. It was dinner time 40 minutes ago. I'm coming across a tree stump. She is just here though. Baba, do you want to come? You are now at Chimney Rock. Would you like to look around? Yes. Wow. It's cold. How do we change the rations? Five. Everyone's full. Like, no. Two. Mega. Come on, guys. Uh, do we want to rest? Sure. Let's just... How many days? Just one. Now it's hot. Continue. Okay. Zazia. Can you come here? Can you come here? Oh, your supplies got wet. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Matt. Fabo. Adam! <laughs> Adam. Adam has exhaustion. I guess we'll rest another day or two, huh? Because of Adam. <laughs> Would you like to look around? Yes. Ooh. Um, stop to rest. Adam. Three days. Um, we'll change the pace to just steady, I suppose. Um, let's look at this map. Oh, we're making good time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I don't need to trade anything. I don't think I need to buy supplies. Let's talk to some people. A mountain man tells you these green hordes heading across the Rockies know nothing about surviving in the mountains. It gets awful cold up there even in summer. Many traveling across the mountains too late in the year got snowbound and died. All right, let's buy a couple more clothes then. Five, five sets. Well, wait, Adam's gonna die soon, so we should be okay. Food, wagon tongues, all that. I mean, uh, a bit of our ammunition got stolen, so buy three boxes. Can we get another ox? Yeah, okay, cool. Eight, leave store. Continue. Look at this. Just Adam, like, if the snake's coming for you, it's, I don't mean to be obvious, but you get out of its way. Oh no, very little water and bad water, very little water. What does that mean? We're thirsty? How is that not with the food? Health, poor? Their health is poor? What the? Change food rations. Health is fair. No, 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 I don't want to change food rations. Everyone's fine. Stop to rest. Just a day. Just a day. Okay. We're back. Zelda has exhaustion? <laughs> Adam pretend I had as much empathy. <laughs> And sympathy for you is Zelda. Baba! Um, I'm sorry. You are now at Independent Rock. Would you like to look around? Yes. Wow. Some rock we got there. Uh, stop to rest. Three days. Zelda. She's in a mood. All right. Continue. Zelda's got exhaustion. <laughs> Adam, we want to go home. Not until we get to our destination, I'm afraid. Alrighty, now it's June. The weather's warm. The weather's hot. We have 200 pounds of food, 95 pounds, 185 pounds of food. We're at the South Pass. Oh, wow. All right, let's buy a little bit more food. Attempt to trade. Oh wait, I don't want to trade anything. No, I want to buy. Check supplies? Talk to people. When the white man first crossed our lands, their wagons were few. Now they crowd the trail in great numbers. The land is overgrazed with their many animals. Do any white men still live in the east? My people talk of moving. We are colonizing at a rapid pace. 
So we'll change that pace. Strenuous. <laughs> and let's get back on the road. Oh, see the map. Are we going to go to Fort Bridger or R Green River? Fort Bridger or Green River? Where's Green River? Where's Green River? Well, if I can't see Green River, I should, probably shouldn't go to Green. There's Soda Springs. There's Fort Bridger. Where's Green River? I feel like this is a trick question. I can't see it at all. Two. Okay. You find an abandoned wagon, but it is empty. Probably because there's... Sorry, Link, I can't help you buy again and I have exhaustion. <laughs> oh, are we going to change rations? Yeah. They're meager at the moment. Alrighty, we're at Fort Bridger. This is pretty impressive. Buy supplies. Let's buy some more food, everyone. Seven. How many pounds? Eighty. I have so much money. I have so much money. Let's buy another ox. Yeah. Uh, check supplies. Oh, I've got so many bullets. That's ridiculous. I didn't. I mean, I bought. I bought boxes when I was supposed to buy individuals. Um, we have eight oxen now. 15 sets of clothing, that's three a piece. I'm happy with that. Let's talk to some peeps. Aunt Rebecca, we should have taken the sublet cutoff. Not enough at this fort worth the time it took to get here and the outrageous prices. Food's not fit to eat, much less to pay for. Some folks would sell the clothes off our backs if we'd let them. Cool, continue on trail. Do we I'll need a lot more food? Oh shoot, more food. Good, good. Oh fuck. Yep, I'm seeing that now. Yes. Alrighty, attempt to trade bullets. I will trade bullets. Are you willing to trade? You meet another emigrant who wants three wagon axles she will trade you one ox oh no i want to buy fuck change food rations bare bones look at that fort hall we're super close to fort hall we'll make it we'll buy more it's cool let's up the pace a little no we don't oh 63 more bullets hunt for food I got bullets. What? Wow. That's lame. Oops. I'm very new to this. I've never done this before. There's a bloody bear. I don't have a Diagon Alley. And I can't shoot past the bear. I'm just shooting into a, hey! Wow. Look at that guys, 100 pounds. And now we're going here, so I'll buy 800 pounds of food. Ah, oh, a thief stole 16 pounds. Alrighty. Wrong trail. Oh. Yes. Buy supplies, food, 800 pounds, cool, leave, continue on the trail. You can walk around, what? Oh, broken wheel, would you like to try and repair it? Yeah, sure, you're unable to repair it, you must replace it, okay. Um, where are we? 
change pace. I don't like grueling. Oh no, strenuous I'm okay with. Um, eight, we'll hunt for some food. I didn't do so bad last time. What the? What? Whose horse is that? Oh. 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 See, when you get them too close, you're stuck. See? Hey! So wing a better. Cool. Can I just keep hunting for food, huh? I don't mind the hunting part. I don't like hunting in real life. Sorry. We don't need to do it. Oh, it's very bare. Whoa, it came out of nowhere. Fuck. 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 Sneaky, sneaky horses. Got him. Got him. All right, continue on the trail. I wouldn't mind looking at the bad water. Uh oh, another wagon wheel. You were able to repair it, yay. Look at the map, where are we going? We're at Fort Hall now. We got a big chunk up ahead of us, okay. Um, stop to rest. We'll do, two, do a sneaky two days. Okay. Um, we'll change the rations because now we got a lot. So meager. And we'll continue. Oh, Dim Daggers! Ah, Dim Daggers, that's so sweet. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Mord Hunter sounds like an 80s metal band, says Brad. Seek. Um, I'm a bit worried about my wagon. Oh, I lost two days going the wrong way. Yes. Yay, I prepared it. Um, let's see what the trade's all about. Uh, they want 190 pounds of food, but they'll trade an ox. <laughs> Yeah. Is that worth it? Yeah. I did it. Um, okay. I wonder how Adam's going in Zelda. Sam. <laughs> Sam. What do I do? Sam. Bruce, there's very little water. You pass a grave site. Would you like to look closer? Yeah, sure. <laughs> cool. <laughs> um, snake River Crossing. I wonder if there's a snake. Uh, let's have a look at the trade here. They want one set of clothing for a wheel. Yeah, done. Um... Continue on the trail. Uh, it's six feet deep in the middle. It's currently a thousand feet across. Oh, that feels wrong, but locals know best. Yes. Great. Look at that. More wagon supplies. Oh, going too fast breaks down the. You had no troubles. Yay. Um, alrighty. So it sounds like I want to just knock the pace back a little bit. Let's go at a steady pace then. Okay. I might hunt for a little bit of food because I like it. Whoa. <laughs> the graphics. I mean, it's 80s. It's 80s. Damn it. Damn it. 
right through my bullets. There's a bear. There's a deer. There's a dead bear. But I got him. I got him. And a dead deer. And a bunny. A bunny, little bunny. I'm happy with that. That's, that just sounds like such a waste. It's like you killed 202, but you can only take 100 with you. Well, uh. all right. You find wild fruit. Cool. Inadequate grass. Cool. Uh, Sam's got dincent, 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 dincent. Oh, you, I can't figure out how to walk around me, Nathan. <laughs> uh, yes, I'd like to look around. Let's buy some supplies. We want a four. You may only carry three wheels. How many have we got? Oh, we've all got, all, got all, all, all of them. Guys, I feel like I've got them max amount. The prices here aren't great, by the way. That's ridiculous. What do I need? Thank you, Alex. That's great. Anything? Little advice? How are we going? We got 548 bucks, like 548. Food. Yeah, I don't want too much food here, it's so expensive. I'll just do a little hundred pound. Where's water? I don't, I don't think you can get water. Alrighty. Talk to some people. You'll not get your wagon over them blue mountains, mister. Leave it. Cross your goods over with pack animals. Get yourself a couple of good mules, pieces of wagon litter to the trail. Left them by folks who don't need heed good advice. Well, I got eight oxen, so I feel good. Um, we'll rest a couple of days here. Okay. Continue on. Steady pace. Look, fair health. I'm happy about it. The weather's a bit cool. We found some wild fruit. Ooh. Weather's warm, weather's hot. A couple of hot days. Baby. What did you do? Tim. Hi, Tim. Tim did a really cool version of um, the moderator, by the way. Looks sick. Very little water. Zelda, can you come here? Zell, <laughs> if you die, <laughs> I will cry. <whistles> come on, Baba, come here. So, Zell, we are at the Blue Mountains. Let's look around. Ooh, this is where someone dies. Talk to people? Tired Overlander tells you, since crossing the snake at four boys, it's been just mountains and desert. Dust deeper each day, six inches at times, no tracks, just clouds of dust. Many cattle choked on the dust. Oh. Look at map. Guys, we're so close. We're so close. I feel good about this. I feel good. I feel. Oh, let's have a look at that map again. Fort Walla Walla or the Dales. The Dales, man, go straight, straight. That's bad water. Bruce has a fever. <laughs> I'm gonna try and move around in my hunt. Nope. That's not letting me move. How do you move around? Hey, Zazel. <laughs> I don't know how to move around. Oh, these are the bullets that I'm wasting. Not a bad one. Let's just continue on the trail before someone dies. Hey, baby girl. Get
Zelda, can you come here, please? Zelda, Zelda, can you come here? She's dead. How is she barking right now, huh? Zelda, can you come here? I need a hug. Zelda, can you come here? I need a hug. Come here. I will tempt you with food. Corpse. Come on. Good girl. I don't know how to tell you this, but we were traveling across country and you died. You you're dead. You died. I I had my eye on the prize and I thought we could make it and um you're dead. I'm sorry I killed you. Thank you for accepting my apology. I'm sorry. Will you forgive me? Okay. Mum of the Year Award. Oh, fuck off, Bruce. David Fogg. I get to it. I don't care. Bruce has cholera. Health is poor. Very little water. Very little water. Ten miles. Come on, guys. Yes, let's look around. I have a corpse. We need to rest. Two days. I have to bury Zelda. What kind of trade have we got here? One wagon axle with 24 pounds of food. No. I don't need it. I don't need it. Uh, change food rations, guys. Filling. But, change pace, I'm going back to strenuous. <sighs> what advice have they got? Cousin Lydia engaged passage down Columbia with Indians at Canoe with 17 people and luggage. Great, cool. Oh. She said that floating down the Columbian River was good, right? Let's do it. Okay. Is this me? Am I doing this? It is me. Great. Zelda's uh... dead. Zelda's dead. Oh, shoot. I looked away up to the chat. <laughs> Nearly died. Oh, what? <gasps> I didn't know that. <sighs> Fuck. Four out of my eight ox? This sucks. I should have just paid a toll. I should have just paid a toll. How long's a river? Don't even think about touching the sides again. What a joke. Ah, oh, the oxen, whatever, but my dog's dead. I'm really bummed about that. This seems to be going okay then. taking its time, isn't it? This is going far too far. Is there nothing else better to do in the 80s? 90s? Wait! 
Was that, was that, does that mean I could have gotten off there? Damn it! Ton of food and bullets. Hey, Woody. Woody. Jiffa Lawson was on the gravestone. Are you kidding me? Oh well, I'm on the map. Would you like to make any changes? Oh no, that was good. Okay. Alrighty, that's uh that's time, guys. Uh, how long have I been going for? Two hours, that's great. I'm gonna go feed Zell, which will be fantastic. Um, I just wanted to give some shout outs though in my mini feed that I can see. Again, Tim, thank you so much for that. Dim Daggers, thank you for your donation as well. Colby, uh, J CJ, thank you so much for following. Sebman, thanks for following. Cosmos System, so great to have you back. Esther Cummings, thank you. Uh, Beau Regards has followed, I appreciate that. Dubwood, Kozo7, and Stephen Summers, thank you for the super chat. Uh, the Jew28 followed, D-E-W, do, do. I just say do and it sounds like something else. Um, Lunatic Gunster, thank you. Lord Rex69, um, Edwin Medgia Photo, Flowers for Aragorn, uh, Vaslisa, Genlock36, Sidex1210, I am bored, Jake Waters, um, ACTC8, Astro Boy, uh, Classy Librarian Raided, which was gorgeous, Kin Kin followed, Jaded, Cats, and Zachary, and I think we're back to all our shout outs. Thank you guys for that. How interesting. I don't think I'd ever played Oregon Trail, and if I had, it wasn't for a very long time, so I didn't really have um, memories on how to do it all. Ended really quickly. I apologize to Zelda. I'm going to go feed her now because of that. Uh, yeah, lots of folk. I appreciate that. Uh, I'm going to try and do it again tomorrow so I can hit my affiliate status and get